Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Plus Size in Canada. My name is Miranda and yes, I'm not at home. This is because I needed a little home break. I just, yesterday I worked so hard at painting Winnie's bedroom and you guys, like I still did all the regular things. I did a bunch of laundry, I still cleaned, I still cooked, I still cleaned up from that, like I did the bus runs, everything. Um, and then I painted on top of that. So um, if you missed that vlog, I'm gonna link it in the description so you guys can watch it. I also painted Winnie's hair and she is pink and purple and gorgeous right now. She absolutely loves how it turned out. And she was so excited to go to school today and show her friends. So that made me proud. It was like the first time I ever dyed anyone's hair um, two colors and gave like the whole like foils thing a try. Um, I think it worked out really good and I'm pretty proud of myself. I still have a little bit of color on my hands today but I also painted my nails this morning. Fabulous, you know, I just, <sighs> I just needed a minute to myself. And there are a few things that I needed from town anyways. We're going to set up our pool, I think actually today, I think Curtis is gonna do the, the bus runs with the fire truck and the water. And anyways, he's on the fire department. So he cleans out the tank of the fire truck and then gets us fresh water for the pool. That's what we did last year. We're going to do it again. I think it's going to happen today. That's as long as there are no actual fire calls. I needed to come to town for a pool cover because if you've ever had a pool before <laughs> and it's June bug season, mm, you need a pool cover because the bugs, they think that the water is their friend, but it's actually a trap for them and they all die, which is good. But I also don't want to swim and have my kids swim in like a bug burial ground. So <laughs> um, anyways, I got to get a pool cover. I'm still looking for something specific for Curtis's Father's Day. Um, if I don't find it, you'll find out what it is on another vlog. If I do find it, I will show you and I will tell Curtis, sorry, babe, you can't watch this vlog. Um, anyways, I'm going to run into Frenchies first because I just needed a Frenchies moment, a minute. Maybe I'll find something cute for myself or for someone else. I'm not going to spend a ton of time in here. It's going to be kind of like a quick trip to town because I am actually really tired from all the work I did yesterday and I wanted to like let my body just chill. But we did go for a walk this morning with Boober and with our dog and Jasper actually ran into a couple of friends. So I took a little quick clip and I will show you guys that now. And say hi. <laughs> hi, Marley. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> oh, there's a new friend. Say hi, new friend. Oh, my goodness, so nice. <laughs> say hi. Oh, Jassy's got two friends. <laughs> then we also took Boober to the park and then we had a chat with our neighbors who are our favorite neighbors and it was just so nice to like talk to somebody you know what I mean oh <sighs> we're getting back to that actually um I think Curtis told me this week will mark 75 percent of New Brunswickers have had their first dose of the vaccine which is wild to me um and exciting and I don't want to get political or whatever like everyone absolutely has the right to their own choice so I'm never going to agree with hating on people that don't get it as well as I'm not going to agree with people hating on people that do get it it's like it's it's your own choice just like if I want to eat Pizza Hut today I will and you don't need to say anything about it but I actually now I want pizza that just <laughs> I'm not planning on getting pizza today um but now I really want to oh dang it <laughs> Anyways, look what I'm parked beside you guys. This is like, um, what are those cars that don't have roofs? You can take the roof off. Uh, conversion, uh, convertible, convertible, convertible. It's that right there. Pretty, huh? Still not as nice as the Jeep. But anyways, I'm just sitting here chatting because I got the heating pad on my back or the heated seat thing, you know what I mean? And it feels so good because... You guys, painting is kind of like hard on your body, especially when you're like really not in good shape. <laughs> I mean, Curtis told me one time Miranda circles the shape. Yes, he did. <laughs> 
but that's fine. I, I am proud of my circle. Like I have come full circle about my circle. Okay. If you don't like it, you don't have to, <laughs> I'm not everyone's type, but <laughs> I'm a lot of people's type. Okay. Like I get those DMS. Don't worry about me. I'm doing just fine. <laughs> Let me just say, no matter what your shape is, confidence is what is sexy confidence and that comes free of charge honey here let me sprinkle a little on you there you go yeah oh don't forget about you there you go get you some confidence we all need it sometimes we need a daily dose but uh it's up to you to rock it work with what you got honey work it okay is it worth it oh, let me work it i put my fang down flip it and reverse it it's your from a nipple it's your from a nipple <laughs> All right, I'm going to go into Frenchies, see if I can find anything fun. Maybe a Disney shirt. I mean, it could be my lucky day. Who knows? You never know until you try. I have to try these. Can you guys tell how tiny this is? It's apparently a 2X. It looks like an extra small to me. These two, double XL. To who? A baby? <laughs> They're tiny. I'm gonna pass on the gold capris, but I think I'm gonna try these. They look maybe like they'll be a little small. They're only an extra large, but I think it's worth the try. How I wish I was a size 14, <laughs> or that this was four sizes bigger. <laughs> Cruella de Vil, be Cruella de Vil. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? It says it's a size 12, but I feel like this would totally fit Winnie. Oh my heck, what a find. There's actually a few fitting rooms open so I can try stuff on here, see if they work and not waste my money if they don't work. But I totally wish that was in my size and I'm so glad I found it for Winnie. Okay, this is just a t-shirt. It's a 2X in the brand Every with an I, never heard of it. But I think this would be perfect to just wear with leggings like I do. <laughs> Definitely gonna get this, I like the color too. This is an extra large old navy tank top. Um, it's a little fitted, but I have this in an extra large at home, but it's purple and I really like it. It's one of my favorite tank tops to wear in the summer. So I should probably pick this one up too. And they can be like sisters in my closet, you know? Now I have purple hair, so I don't even know if I can wear that purple shirt anymore. It might clash. Ooh, we gotta be careful with our purples. <laughs> I am really hoping both of these leggings work or even just one of them would be awesome. I'm gonna try this one, a double extra large. They fit, but they're not super comfortable. And I feel like it's a no. It's a no, they're not comfortable, then they're not for me. I only do comfort, honey. <laughs> We're gonna try this lucy.com and hope for the best. I'm loving the color combination. You see what's happening? But I am not loving the way these make me feel. It's a no for me, dog. Big time no. I have a list. I'm gonna pop into Walmart. I'm gonna see if I can get everything that's on this list. I'm gonna hold it in my hand. I'm gonna try really hard. Let's see if I can do it, guys. Do you believe in me? <laughs> It's all right. You all know I'm coming back to down tomorrow. Actually, I think we're going to do Costco tomorrow. <laughs> I just was not in the mood to do Costco today. So hopefully tomorrow I wake up with like that. Woo! Let's go get you a glizzy, honey. Kind of attitude. You know what I mean? All right. I'll see you guys in Walmart.
this is what's left of the pool stuff. Yikes. <laughs> It's like last year all over again. Since Walmart didn't have the pool cover, I'm gonna try my luck at Crappy Tire. Hopefully this is it. I'm gonna get it and hope I did good. <laughs> you never really know till you open the box or till you drop it on the floor. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I'm back home and I'm gonna do a quick little grocery slash fun stuff haul before the girls get back from school. Curtis just went down to get them. Um, I'm about to show you a table with a few things on it um, that somehow equal $178. I didn't really get that much stuff. So <laughs> um, I guess I got some stuff that was pretty pricey, but I, I literally checked my receipt and I was like, I still don't know how it happened. Let me show you. This right here is everything that I got. Almost 200 bucks. Youch. I guess I'm just used to spending money. <laughs> I just don't understand how quickly it goes away. Anyways, it is what it is. My guess on this haul before I put it up on the till was like maybe like 140, 120 would be nicer. 178, all right, it is what it is. I'm gonna start with the most exciting thing for me. You may have noticed in the footage before this that I picked up some strange colors. I'm gonna try a Franken color. I'm gonna do a little mixing in the future because I'm still not the color I want to be. Don't get me wrong, I love my hair. I just, I want it to be like, like a Barbie color um, purple, like a frosted purple. Like, almost like what it is up here at the root, um, but everywhere, so you know what I mean? It's hard, I don't know, it's hard to explain. I did see a few pictures of exactly the color that I want and the only hair dye that I have found with that exact color is a permanent hair dye and I'm scared to use a permanent hair dye because I'm not a hair stylist or hairdresser. I just do it for fun and I don't want to ruin anything and I know permanent hair dye is way more damaging on your hair and I like to have fun with it so I'm just going to stick with the semi-permanents for now. Um, I'm just going to see what happens. I'm not doing it today. You'll see it when I do it. Hopefully I don't go bald. <laughs> but you know what? Bald people are hot. Like I know one. <laughs> I sleep with one actually. <laughs> so each of these were $11.98. So that's probably like, you know, where some of the majority of the cash was spent. Um, right here too, this also. Um, this is my favorite. Whatchamajigger? What do you call this thing again? Um, shaver? Razor? Um, white tea comfort glide. These are so good. I don't actually need this little doohickey thing. I already have one, but it comes with five cartridges and this is 20 bucks guys, 20 bucks, but you don't need, um, shaving cream. It's got that. See that little bits right there. That's actually shaving cream works really good. Smooth legs forever. Let's do it. Um, got some of Winnie's Canada fudgicles. She has decided she prefers the Canada fudgicles now. Um, she thinks that there's a little bit more in them because it goes further down on the stick. It's not as thick as other ones, but this is the one she likes. And I actually think she's right. I prefer the taste of these ones above anything else. That was $5.98-ish, something like that. Um, ice cream, guys. Ice cream was on sale. Um, this was $3.97, so I got the French vanilla, and I got the Oreo, and then this one I think was also $3.97, but it's a different brand, um, Cotton Candy. We're doing that today. It's flipping hot out there. Flipping, flapping hot out there, so we're going to have some ice cream today. Um, I needed some more cream sunscreen for in the house because it's all in the trailer. Um, I, I know I'm going to have to buy more than this. I'm just hoping I can find like a bulk pack of the cream at Costco. I did already buy the bulk pack of the spray, 
but I don't like to spray my kids faces like that just it's a no for me um and I got this for Skye because the other day he came out of his bedroom and he's like mom I think I need some more deodorant because every time I push too hard on this it falls out and um it's scraping my arm every time and I'm like yes you need more deodorant I got you um hello how fun are these I got a few texts from some of my friends telling me Miranda, you're missing something. Go check this out. And they were right. My dollar or my Walmart had this and I'm so excited to give them a try. They're just face masks. Um, I might let Winnie do one with me. I was thinking maybe she would do Ariel and I would do Belle. They were $5 each. So like, I mean, yeah, not super cheap, but still just for fun. I thought, yes, I have to. Um, I got two of these. They were two for six. So we got some cupcakes and some um, what are these called? Man, words, unicorn. <laughs> Winnie is going to be super excited that I got those because she loves both of those so much. And then also I bought these for Winnie because she told me that her teacher said she could bring some new markers to school if she wanted for the end of the year, because I think a couple other friends did bring some highlighters or something and it made her want to bring some too. And then I think normally her teacher only allows stuff that like her teacher wants like actually she sent home at the beginning of the year she sent home like a book bag filled with stuff that she didn't want Winnie to have so it's like I understand she doesn't want other kids to feel left out if they don't have the cool stuff um but at the same time it's like I bought that <laughs> you know what I mean anyways I'm not the teacher so I'm sure if I was a teacher I would understand more um but now she's saying that um, you can bring fun stuff. So I've got Winnie a new pack of markers. I am going to go to the Dollarama and get her some highlighters because she wants highlighters like this other kid has. Anyways, see, that's maybe that's why the teacher doesn't. I, I totally understand. I just also understand the side of the mom who wants her kid to have a mermaid pencil crayon box or bag. Yes, sequence. Anyways, whatever. <laughs> So I got these for Winnie. They were $5. I got some of my favorite lettuce, you guys. I just really like this. This is what I call Subway lettuce um, because, you know, like, or like, you know, even McDonald's lettuce. It's just cut so nice and little and it's nice and clean. And, ooh, I didn't know it was non-GMO. Nicely done. Fresh Express. Um, I got some hot dog buns for hot dogs tonight. Curtis said he would cook some up on the barbecue. And I was like, okay. Let me get some hot dog buns because that means all I'm cooking tonight is some original craft dinner to go with the hot dogs and he can do that. So we're sharing the chore together. Um, I got some shreddies for Curtis and some honeycomb for Curtis. The post cereals were on sale for $2.97 this week, which is a great deal. And then this pizza Friday is coming actually. When you're watching this, it is pizza Friday. So, um, yeah. We're going to try this pizza because it was on sale for $3.33. And I thought, damn, let's try it. And then, of course, I had to buy Winnie her classic Delicio because picky eaters don't like new things. Um, but three meat, bacon, pepperoni, and quattro fromaggi sounds very good to me. Skylar helped me bring the groceries in, and he was like, wow, is that for tomorrow? I'm like, heck yeah. And he's like, that looks good. Anyways, we'll give it a try. Hopefully it's delicious and hopefully I don't burn them. Um, to go with our ice cream, of course, we had to get some goblets <laughs> or ice cream cups or ice cream cones. Um, I got two boxes of them because you can never have enough cones. <laughs> Name that movie. They were cones. They were cones. <laughs> I got a chicken. I'm going to have that for lunch with some lettuce, some tomatoes and cucumbers and other veggies that I have in the fridge gonna make up a nice salad get all this stuff put away I'm excited to have ice cream but I need to eat real food I actually just remembered I haven't even had breakfast yet today totally forgot wasn't hungry at all um one I was gonna say 139 <laughs> it's 139 <laughs> oh my heck uh I don't know if this is the right thing it was definitely more expensive than the last one we bought but it's also a little bit different so hopefully that's the right thing that was 40 bucks and then um, Curtis needed some steel tent pegs. I don't know what they're for, but he texted me that he needed them. So I got them. Jasper went to the school to pick up the girls with Curtis. But look what I got him at Frenchie's. <laughs> I got him a little kitty. I thought he would love that. Um, I spent $35 at Frenchie's. 
I only got two things for myself. I just got that black tank top, which I'm sure I will get a lot of wear out of it. And then I also got the red shirt. I'm so glad that um, Frenchie's, why can't I talk today? Holy crap. Um, I was gonna say sous-vêtement. Where is that even coming from? I know what it is, but where is it coming from? Um, changing rooms. <laughs> I'm so glad Frenchie's changing rooms are open again. So I don't need to waste my money anymore. And I can actually physically try stuff on and decide if I want to buy it or not. So I'm happy that I grabbed this shirt too. I think it's actually really cute. And it's that like really buttery material. So yay for me. Um, also, let me just tell you. I hate uncomfortable clothes. I was thinking about this while I was driving um, from Frenchie's to Walmart. I was thinking, I really, really hate uncomfortable clothes. And I just, I think a lot of us are probably in the same place right now where it's like, we've been wearing our comfy clothes now for a year and a half and um, it's been wonderful. And I don't wanna go back. No, I, I really don't wanna go back. So I basically think, from here on out, I'm just going to be comfortable all the time. And like, sure, if we're going to like a wedding or something fancy like that, then of course I will dress up um, for that event. But if there's no event, I'm going to be in my buttery ass leggings and a big old t-shirt. The majority of the time. Yes, I absolutely will. This is a good life for me. This is a great life for me. I work from home, I'm doing YouTube, I am babysitting, and I'm being a mom. So bring on the big t-shirts and buttery ass leggings. Ow! <laughs> I just did a sexy like, oh, ass move, but you didn't see it because you're up a little too high for me. Anyways, you know it was awesome. Ass moves are the best. <laughs> I grabbed these for Cooper because one thing about Cooper is he hates pants. Speaking of comfortable clothing, he hates jeans. Let me say that. Jeans or anything with a button and honey, like I get you, like same, okay? So he does like these kind of pants that are like, would you call them a parachute pant or something? I don't know. They're kind of like a cargo pant. They go like this at the ankle and they go like this at the waist. And I think these might be a little long for Cooper for right now. Um, but there's a lot of room for, he's got the juiciest butt in the family, guys. He really, like, it's, everyone knows it. Curtis is, is the second most juiciest. Winnie and I are both sad that we don't get the juicy rear. Um, <laughs> because it's, it's a beautiful butt, let me tell you. I shouldn't say that. Like, he's going to be so embarrassed. <laughs> don't tell him I said that, okay? It's just between you and me. Anyways, I got these for him. Hopefully, they fit. And like I said, like, if you're thrifting for clothes, I'm thinking those will be for back to school um, because it's basically shorts weather from here on out. Um, anyways, yes, if you're thrifting clothes, you need to start shopping for back to school clothes like yesterday because they really do go. Like the month of August, ugh, I don't even want to go thrifting in August at all because the stores are crawling with kids and their parents. So it's like the energy of like stress and I, I don't want any part of it. <laughs> I found this for Winnie, um, just a size seven, eight. What is this? Faded glory. Just another under the t-shirt tank top. Um, you guys, I can't wait to show her this. Like this is stunning to me. Hello. Isn't that so cute? Mickey. Oh, Mickey, you're so fun. And then I found this kitty cat one and I thought it's a little too big for you, honey, but I'm going to buy it anyways, because I know she'll love it. Um, and then I found this black t-shirt and if you're wearing a lot of like activity on one area of your body like if you got like a super vibrant t-shirt you should have like maybe a little bit like more chill leggings and if you have a uh, super vibrant leggings then maybe you should chill a little bit on the top anyways I mean you can do whatever you want but that's how I like it um and sometimes I let Winnie totally do what she wants to do put on what you want like I, I'm not gonna fight with you over what you want to wear you know what I mean but um, sometimes she wants me to pick out her clothes. So I got this cute little black t-shirt for when she wants me to pick out her clothes. <laughs> and then again, this is a little bit too big. I don't think it has a size on it anyways. I'm trying to see, no, there's no size, but you'll see why I bought it. Okay, in three, two, one. I know, 
I know, wait for it. Enjoy. Look at it. Look, even the genie. Oh, a boo. Oh, the lamp, the diamond in the rough. Beautiful, right? So it's a little too big. I'd say it's probably like a kid's large. Anyways, she's going to adore it. And I know she is. And I'm glad I got it for her. So now I got to put that ice cream away before it melts and have some lunch. And then, then we'll eat some ice cream. Is it good? <laughs> yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, don't eat the wrapper. Jasper did that before, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you wish. Is that for you, buddy? Is that going to be your new toy? <gasps> Yay! Good boy, Jassy. <laughs> Did you get a new toy? Oh my goodness! <laughs> Was that a funny laugh? <laughs> Is that cool? <laughs> He's freaking out. <laughs> wow, that guy's got one big hose. <laughs> Everybody say cheese out! <laughs> okay, we got it. That's good. That's good. Boober, you're doing it, bud. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Whoa! <laughs> he was a little nervous, so he needed his Randa. Cute. We're all getting sprayed. <laughs> yes. Not the first day. <laughs> These girls are playing chicken with the water. You hear that sound? This is Sounds like summer to me. <laughs> okay, I found you this little fancy black shirt. This orange tank top. <laughs> this kitty shirt. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> This Mickey Mouse Disney dress. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, you ready for the best one? A whole new world. <laughs> A dazzling place I never knew. Do you love it? <gasps> oh, she's beautiful. And look what's on the back. You got Genie, Abu, Aladdin. Awesome, huh? Thank you. You're welcome, Mama. Okay, guys, we're going to end the vlog here. I have a lot of cleanup to do, and I have to cook supper. Um, I don't know if Curtis is actually going to be back in time because he needs to clean up stuff from the truck. This girl is mad because she really wants to go in the pool so bad that she kind of already did. If you no, can tell. I, I've put my arm in. Oh, yeah, just your arm. Nothing else. Turn around, turn around. Nothing else at all went in the water. Just her arm. 
<laughs> Maybe a little bit more than just her arm. Anyways, I have a lot to do, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Jasper, we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> we love you guys so much. Thanks for hanging out with us. See you soon. Bye. <laughs> Jassy, where'd your new toy go? <gasps> where's your new toy? Where'd it go? Let's go find it. Where is it? Let's go get it. Oh, that's not your new toy. Oh, nuts. That's Boobers. Where is it? Jassy, where's your new toy? Let's go. Look. Oh, there it is. Oh, get your toy, buddy. Get it, get it. Oh, good job, buds. Good job, Butterboo. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we love you guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>